It was a hard-fought race. Uh, we had a, we had a lot to go up against. Uh, you know, obviously we had uh, you know a campaign on the other side that uh, you know put a million dollars into it and had the uh, vice president running around uh, knocking on doors. Uh, but listen, I feel great. Uh, we worked hard. We stuck to the issues. Uh, we, we didn't sway. Um, we we stay positive. Um, so my, my only hope, obviously, is first off, I'd like to congratulate both my opponents. Um, you know, my hope is is the same as it's always been. I, I truly want Delaware to be a better place. Uh, I hope they can accomplish that. Uh, we have a lot of issues in the state of Delaware uh, that need to get fixed. And, and a lot of people that uh, I spoke to up and down the district recognize that. I mean, we have issues, you know, with the crime and the, and the, and the public education system and our economy. Uh, so, you know, this, these are the issues that, that drove me to run. Uh, so uh, it's my hope that our legislators can go down there and the majority party uh, once and for all crosses the, crosses the aisle and, and works with the Republican Party to get things done. This particular campaign was outspent by a million dollars. This wasn't a race between uh, the Republicans and the Democrats in Delaware. This was a race by the Republicans in Delaware against the Democrat National Committee. And, and it is what it is. Certainly 11 to 10 is better than we've ever had in the past. And I think that uh, we have a lot of potential to move forward on some of our issues. Uh, obviously, it will be tougher without having the majority. Uh, but this was a good race. Uh, I want to commend John, he worked very hard, had hundreds of volunteers that, that worked for months really uh, on this campaign and it was, and it was a good campaign. Uh, John worked extremely hard and I'm happy uh, for him uh, because he left the race with his head high.